What is up and what is good YouTube? It is your boy Savannah. I'm back at you with your video now. <laughs> your boy's back. Um, I know I didn't upload on New Music Friday like I was supposed to, but I have excuses. Number one, Friday 2K come out. I'm sorry, 2K came out. I had got it at nine and I was playing it all. Listen, 2K is popping this year. I'm messing with it. They got a new upgrade system. If you play 2K, let me know how y'all feel about it. Down, I've been playing for a couple days. Took a little break today, you know, so I could do this video for y'all. And I had church and stuff. So, yeah. Um, let me know what y'all think. You know, is it a good game? Is it a copy from last year? I think it's a copy, but it has improvements. And I think it's definitely a, a step above last year's game. But enough about the game. We got the song Hollywood's Bleeding off of Post Malone's newest album, Hollywood's Bleeding. The uh, main reason why I'm just doing this one is because uh, I've been doing a little bit of experiments. Like I've been trying to, you know, get more people, you know, more people to be active and stuff. So I'm like, you know, I'm going to do it again in this video for y'all. I'm going to listen to the, the title of the album, the song that's the title of the album, and get a good feel of the album. If you guys want a general reaction and you guys want me to react to the actual album, y'all let me know in the comment section below. But I just want to see it and get a good feel. I heard this is probably one of the more deeper songs in the album, so I'm excited to get my opinion on it. I hope y'all ready. Hollywood's Bleeding. Post Malone is definitely up there, my opinion, in today's music. He's a really good, dope artist. But I cannot wait to get into this. I hope y'all ready. Let's get straight into it. Okay, let's hop right into it. It's three. Do you do that, that? The vocals is what be getting me on these songs, especially with Post Malone. They be knowing St. John, Post Malone. They all be knowing. One's gone, but no one's leaving. Nobody left. This, this sounds, this is like, a, oh my gosh, this is beautiful, man. This is the Post Malone that I be talking about. This is the one, you know, my favorite song by Post Malone is called Cold. If you have never checked out the song Cold by Post Malone, you're slacking. It's one of his, uh, in my opinion, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, it's probably... Whoa, my ring light tripping. Hold on, y'all. All right, y'all. Sorry. Probably my, it's, I think it's his most, his best song. You know, Congratulations is good, but Cold reaches another levels to me. Like I said, if you haven't heard it, check it out. But I like melody songs like that, and this just gives me the same vibes. He said, yeah, Hollywood is bleeding but we call it home. See, that has multiple meanings to me. And I really, I've been ready to break this down. I'm thinking, this is just how I think. Let me know how y'all think about this in the comments. I think of this, he said, so Hollywood, he said, but Hollywood is bleeding, but we call it home. So what I take from that is, a lot of artists are dying, you know, not just, you know, not talking about like Hollywood or not necessarily always in Hollywood, but I'm seeing it like a big shot type of thing, you know, like somebody who made it in life, you know, they're, you know, we're losing a lot of them, but like, you know, a lot of artists still call Hollywood home, still call, you know, being famous, that's still their home, they're still their domain. So I don't know if y'all dug that deep in it like I did, but let me know what y'all thought. And if y'all think that mine, you know, let me know. Just let me know in the comment section below. He says she got to check her pulse to see if she okay. Let 
isn't um Apollo Santo? Isn't that one of them type of candles? He said Apollo Santo for all these demons. Wish I wish I could just go on. Isn't that one of the Mexican candles that they had that they used during a, like around the Day of the Dead? They keep away the evil spirits and stuff. If it is, that's clutch. That's just the first track of the album. That's just the intro. That's the. That's just the intro. This is ridiculous. This song is a 10. The melody. Post Malone is great with making songs, you know, that has that, you know, the melody that, you know, that can get you in your feelings or get you, you know, grooving and stuff. I mess with this hard. Like I said, this is probably like a top Post Malone song. I'm a low, key, I'm, I'm not, a lot of people don't know this, but I'm a huge Post Malone fan. I just don't outwardly show it. But I mean, if you guys show love in the comments and stuff, I will go ahead and I'll do more Post Malone content if that's what y'all want. I'm here for y'all. I'm here so y'all can tell me what y'all want to see so I can give that to y'all. But the song is a 10. Let me know in the comment section down below if you want me to check out the whole album. And yeah, good job, Post Malone. I hope the album gets on a billboard. You deserve it. Just this song alone shows me you deserve it. All right, YouTube, that's going to do it for me on this YouTube video. Thank you all for being patient with me. I'm sorry for the technical difficulties on Saturday. I'm, I really apologize. But... I'm back on it. No more skipping. You know, it's back to the 12. It's back to the 12 o'clock in the morning. You know, Friday, New Music Friday videos. We going back to that. This was just like an off couple weeks. We're not about to fall off like that. I got some story times for y'all coming up. I got other reactions coming up. I got vlogs coming up. I hope y'all ready. Oh, yeah. Summer's over, but fall, we about to heat up. I promise you. I'm Savon Don. I'm out.